So as I said, one of the things in life that you want to do is you want to plan on things not going to plan. The power's been out for about four hours, so I'm just hoping that they're all going to be all good. I don't really know what I can do. We had to take us. We decided to take the dogs out today and we're going to test their speed with a radar gun. So last time we did this, Kong was fastest. So we'll see if his son can make him proud. Holy there's a lot going on here at DDK. We're about to launch our new dog food. We're starting the Kennel Club. Very excited for these new ventures. Day to day, it's a lot of exercising the dogs, taking videos and pictures and lots of training. I kind of do everything. Taking care of the animals, taking care of the kids, opening up businesses, kind of do it all. Would you say one of your main jobs is keeping Marlon in mind? I wish that I could say that was possible. <laughs> One of Marlon's sayings is always plan on something going wrong. And uh, he's definitely right this time because today we woke up and we have no power. Power's been out for about four hours, so I'm just hoping that they're all gonna be all good. You wanna live in the mountains? Yeah, you want much dogs? This is what it's like. So I hope the power company takes care of stuff quickly because we have a lot of stuff that we need to do today. We had to improvise. You know, I've always wondered how fast my dogs could run. So I bought a radar gun. Uh, one, of, one of the most important things for me is like, you know, team building, you know, it's like camaraderie, is making sure that people are having fun. So I figured I'll make everybody run. Oh, that was, that was, it said 15 miles an hour, bro. <laughs> Testing the humans first. I got 17. 14. Yeah, 15. Lisa's gonna run nine. Go ahead. I got 16. Overside, you sugar-coated track stars. Let the ice rasta show you how it's done. I am the Usain Bolt of my house. Victory is mine. All right, so let's bring out the first dog, Sosa, and we're gonna see how fast he is. Right, we have about one shot at this, so hopefully we got good. Whoa! I got 26. So Sosa came blazing out of the gates with a high score of 26 miles per hour. So he set the bar pretty high in the beginning. So up next, we got Nikki. We'll see what she can do. 22 miles an hour for Nikki. I was expecting a little more out of Nikki, but she hit 22, it's not bad. She didn't stick the ground, but it's, it's okay. All right, so up next, we got Roxy. She's gonna come right out and she's probably gonna run into me. Come on, girl. Oh, hit it. Woo! So we got 24 out of Roxy. Roxy's like, all right, get this shot of my milkshake. It has brought all the boys to the yard. She still didn't beat Sosa. She didn't beat her son. She got, you know, upstarred by her son, but it's okay. Hulk would just hurt himself. He would probably run fast. Last time we did this, I think we had Hulk at like 23 or 4. He's booking! All right, so next up, we got Casper coming out. We're all gonna have to watch our knees. He's looking like he's really excited, and I think he's gonna flatten somebody. So I don't I don't know if that's accurate or not. So he came out and I got scared. So I don't know if 22 is accurate or not. So we're gonna try again. And I'm gonna try to not get scared this time. But I was scared for my knees. Hey, hey, all right. Gained a mile per hour. 23, 23. Casper did pretty good. Beat Nikki. Didn't beat Sosa. Sosa's still reigning supreme. Get I got one more left. So we're gonna bring out Kano and we're gonna see if, you know, he can become the champion. His dad was the former champion. All right, so this is Kano, this is Kong's son. Kong was the fastest dog in my house. Last time we did this, Kong was fastest. So we'll see if his son can make him proud. Holy 25. Sosa won. That would mean Sosa won. Kano is not the next champion. He was cups. Man, listen, Kano got a 25. But truthfully, truthfully, so you guys know, Kong still holds the cake. He ran a 28. And that was all pure excitement coming out of the house. Dude, I told you. I told you, Dad. I told you I was the fastest here. Champion and have him a boy. So Sosa's the winner, but uh, he's still got to go up against this guy. Now I'm going to race him, and we're going to see really who's the fastest in this house. Honestly, I think Marlon's gonna get it just because I don't think we're gonna get Sosa at his full speed. But I think Sosa could run faster than him if he really gave it his all. He 
succeeded! He may or may have not ran straight, but it's fine. A victory is victory. That was good fun, you know? Like I said, when you're doing serious things and you're building big companies, having fun and, you know, camaraderie is just a huge part of the success of the business. That's what we're all about. This is Tyson here. I is Iron Mike. What are you doing there? Fell up. Mike's 15. And he can't see everything. He can hear though. Yeah, he has a little bit of selective hearing, this guy, I think. What are, what are humans like at 105? <laughs> Marina, what do you do? Hey. I am the jack of all trades. I do everything. Chris, what do you do? I make noises. Power's back on. I still can't see. The power's back on. We can finally get on with our day. We have way too much to do. So one of my partners is coming out today, Shy, that we do our Hulk shampoo with and you know, our, also our dog treats. And we're also, we got something pretty big in the pipeline. We're developing our own dog food with him. So today he's gonna bring us a sample of the dog food, which is super exciting and crazy. It's here. People always ask us what we feed our dogs. I think people think that there is some magic food that makes our dogs big and look the way that they look. In reality, there's not. Feeding your dog a good diet is important to healthy growth and development, but there isn't some special food that makes Hulk as big as he is, unfortunately. So Shai just got here, came with the dog food. I felt like, you know, I might get a little bit of milk and a spoon and take a sample myself. But I'm gonna get some of the dogs out now and uh, we're gonna see what they think of it. I think this is the most exciting part. Let's get to it. We got hungry mouths to feed. Look at Hook, bro. He's like, dude, you got food? No way. What's in there? All right, right, it took a matter of seconds and it's Hulk approved. It's instantly Hulk approved. What do you think, bro? What do you think? I think he likes it. He's like, dude, yo, yo, let's get, is, what you got? You got more? I think it's definitely Hulk approved. All right, Jake, you wanna try too? We'll give you a try. Oh, and Bruno's in here too, oh my God. Wanna try? Okay, well, it's Bruno approved. Oh my God. Bruno likes it too. Look, let's, look, let's, let's, let's Jake try, let Jake try. No, no, he's eating it off the ground. It's Drake approved, it's Drake approved. So I think that went well. I think it's safe to say that they like the food and we have a good formula for dogs. So I am excited. It's, I, I still can't believe this is even real. I am super excited. We've been talking about dog food for such a long time now and to have it become reality and to have my dogs eat our own dog food and to see Hulk's face on the dog food, it's all coming together. I'm really excited for the future. DDK is still going strong. The opportunities are endless, so I'm really excited to continue and uh, see what the future holds. Bruno is our special puppy. The dog is adorable. When he was just weeks old, we knew something wasn't right. Bruno broke two of his ribs, and so I, we took him to the vet. They said that he'd have to be put to sleep at that point. This was eight weeks ago, and he just got better and better and better. And now he doesn't stop. He's defied everything that we were told. He definitely thinks he's one of the big dogs. He has no fear. Where's Bruno? Where's Bruno? Little Bruno is gone. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where he is. 